Hello everyone. We hope you all are doing well. Welcome to another fantasy preview. This is a different kind of fantasy preview where we are going to preview out what are the three best players that you can pick in the upcoming India versus Sri Lanka series and apart from that also some insight on how you can actually use some of these India OG cards that are going to be you will be able to use multiple times across the next one month because India is going to be playing 11 limited overs games in Jan and the 12th one is not far away it's on Feb 1st itself so yes a lot of utility of your cards over there so we'll get to that first nikhil bhai what do you feel what are the kind of og cards would you like want to prosper with someone like a sevag up top with the kind of opponents that we have in sri lanka or do you want to prosper with an all rounder how do you see that going and what are the cards that you'll be looking out for with sri lanka and new zealand both in mind so that you can be able that so that you can use those cards multiple times I think the number one card that is going to be among a lot of uh, reckoning is Yusuf Patan, batter number four. Mm-hmm. Uh, because very smartly, if you see the two guys who are most likely to bat there are going to be either Surya or mm-hmm. you may say Hardik. Uh, mm-hmm. Again, depending on how the Indian top three shapes up. But again, Sevag an option is a great one, batter one. Because if Ishan Kishan that is, and he's taking off, he'll win you one game by all himself. So, uh, hmm. I think that is the one way to think about it. And the biggest advantage Chakko uh, hota from the OG cards is they make you eligible to play more games. As opposed hmm. to say a specific player card. Abhi samjho agar kal Ishan Kishan nahi khel rahe, but after unka card hai. So, then you are like, okay, uh, now I'll need another card to play for this game. But agar hmm. aapko OG card hai, seva ka, to koi bhi number one pe batting kare. Wo to definitely khelne wala hai. To wo Mm-hmm. Pricing bhi isi ke liye OG cards ke waise hai, kyunki unka use waise hai. So I think agar OG cards milte hai, to jitne mile utne best hai. Yes, so practically that's what sums it up. You should try to get some India OG cards because you'll be able to use them 11 to 12 times over the next one odd month. And when we show you the price pools, you'll understand why. So if you can see on your screen the price pools here. This is the bronze price pool. Now you can see that even at the last rank, you're getting back 80 rupees, 80 or $1, however you want to call it. Now, when you see the pack pricing, it's generally four to five dollars. So once you get that card, now there are two cards in each pack generally. So practically one card costs you about two and a half dollars and you're able to use that card 11 to 12 times and you have a good chance of hitting that 80. And then if you go all the way to the right towards the black contest, here you can see that even at the last price, there is about $8. So yes, you have a good chance of being able to recover that investment even when your team doesn't work because these are the lowest ranks that I'm talking about. When you look higher up the ranks and the pricing is only better. If you see the top 10 to 15% get real cash winnings, they also, and if you see those prices, none of it is short of uh, looking at. If you see like the 33rd rank is also a $25 or rupees 2000. And the first prize is rupees 24,000. And keep in mind that you can use these cards multiple times, right? Like once you, even if you win that rupees 24,000, it does not mean that the cards are taken away from you. You continue to have those cards and you can continue to use them in the next game or unlimited amount of times. There's no limit there. So I think this is the month for you to chase some good India yep. cards. And also just, just like you said, you can compare it with that if you're taking up different amount of packs as opposed to say OG cards and you can see how it values ke aapke OG card ki value hamesha zada hi rahegi over a period of time as well kyunki aage direct use se relation hai uska to jo value for money hota hai wo bhi mujhe lagta hai OG card se aapko zada better nikal ke aata hai to aur ye price pool ka part to hai hi aapke liye to make the most of and yes because a lot of big names are not playing this could really be a very handy time for you uh, to start getting those differential strategy picks going Yes, absolutely. So now that we are talking about differential strategy picks, we'll talk about the three best picks that you can make, three best cards. So first up, we'll start with Nikhil Bhai and hear his thoughts on who are the three cards that he'll watch out for. And also a bit of strategy on that. Many people, they tend to shuffle their strategy game after game. But how we how we back even in 11 player fantasy, we tend to back certain two or three players every time. If you start doing that, that's what's worked a lot for me on Raviers. Try to back a combination at least across a series and see if that pays off for you. Because there will be a point where those players will click 
and that will be the time that you because obviously you have also put in some thought and you have yeah. you are thinking of something before making those players your captain or by picking those three players in the squad so you should try and back them and see if that comes off for you obviously unless you have strong reasons to change or drop people which is also fair so nikhil bhai who are your three picks then yes i completely agree to jo agar aapne nahi suna to please wapas se wo part suno kyunki koi bhi type ka गेम हो वो इट इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट टू बैक जो आपका इनिशियल था था हम बहुत दफा आफ्टर थॉट में काफी कंफ्यूज हो जाते हैं एंड वी चेंज आर स्ट्रेटेजी बेस्ड ऑन द रिजल्ट्स बट इट शुड एक्चुअली बी बेस्ड ऑन द लॉजिक इफ द लॉजिक वाज राइट यू शुड कंटिन्यू टू बैक देम एंड विद दैट सेड आई एम नेमिंग थ्री प्लेयर्स दो काफी ट्रिकी हैं एक कॉमन है तो जो सेफ जो सबसे ज्यादा कॉमन ऑप्शन वो होगा यूसुफ पठान सर का ओजी का बैटर फॉर अगर सूर्य हार्दिक जो भी वहां पे बैटिंग कर रहा है आपको उसमें वो फायदा हो जाएगा वहां पे so that is the one card that i'm sure many people will target and uh, apart from that i'm going for one very explosive option in nishan kishan uh, again we saw what he can do versus bangladesh jis din wo chalenge agar unhe kyunki ab wo spot unke liye waisa hai it's also important to see where he bats to so, ye bhi agar aapko koi inclination milta hai ki ha kishan open karenge ya niche khelenge jahan pe bhi khelenge to so, waisa you can strategize agar wo open kar de to mujhe lagta hai he's a very good card to take because he can give you those 60 70 extra boundary points as well jo kafi important ho jate to get over your competition if they don't have that card so i think ishan kishan is one such option and other one from sri lanka is dhuvan tushara i think a lot of us who follow the lpl know what he brings to the table or kyunki wo end overs mein dalte hain aapko wickets aise mil sakte hain aur agar india wapas attacking khel rahi hai so definitely he'll always be in the game if he plays so Uh, of course first concern is kon khel raha hai kahan khel raha hai and then if they all if they are playing i think they should be a very hand they should be very handy for you right very fair picks so to sum it up yusuf pathan uh, ishan kishan was the second one right yep yes and noan tushara so yep. those are nikhil bhai's three picks my three picks so i have tried to put them on the screen here for you so that it's easier to understand and because my memory is also pathetic like you saw when i was trying to sum up his picks but yes i've gone with ashdeep singh vanindu hasranga and harshal patel now vanindu hasranga you don't need any explanation he'll be at least out of six games i'm expecting at least two games he should be the top point giver for sri lanka with the kind of play he is especially when he's bowling under pressure ashdeep singh should be able to rattle especially if he gets that movement up front and harshal patel is to complement the same rattling at the death so yes harshal or umran whoever one of the two whoever plays i am expecting probably both should play for starters but if both play yeah. then harshal will be the third pick so this will probably be the kind of combination that i'll try to back across the series bilkul to jaise humne kaha aap jo playing line pe kaafi depend hoga aur first games of a series of a season are always important because you know india is going to do a lot of experiments in the t20 setup so gaikwad hai tripathi hai samson hai you will have plenty of options so just be sure of their roles and then you can back whoever you feel will the difference try to be different because that's what will get you rank one aap common picks ke sath jaoge to i am not saying aap teen hi differential jao do common rakho par ek differential to aapko definitely lagega to climb that ladder yes absolutely and expect these packs to come out before the game day so from the information yeah. that we have the packs should come out before the game day and pricing will be pretty much similar with the 4 and 11 dollar packs for bronze and silver and the picks will be revealed later and also yeah. keep in mind that because many of you have already played the LPL and other tournaments try and make best use of the cards that already have xp so like you can see i've tried to pick cards in certain contests that have xp so try to make use of that advantage especially if you have already played on radio and you you've already reaped that part of the benefit done the hard work of collecting the xp mm-hmm. so try and make best use of that and if you're new to this content in the description there is a sign up link you'll get a free 20 dollars so even you are part of the benefit and apart from mm-hmm. that you i've also going to attach all the explainers in this so yeah. that you are able to understand how the concept works we hope that all mm-hmm. of you enjoy the series india versus sri lanka it should be fun and six Uh, six uh, limited overs games so along with the india cards even your lpl cards will be of good use to your to you yes. here so make the most out of them yes let's have a good game and we'll see you very soon